Today we will learn how to adjust the dial indicator to your needs. This is particularly useful for switching between the left-handed and right-handed versions of the dial indicator. I will show you how to turn the dial around and how to move the lifting lever to the other side. This screw allows to rotate the dial. I only tighten it a very little bit because we need to do adjustments later on. This screw is for the lever. Put it to the other side. Lock it. And now we do the final adjustments because I want the long pointer on zero and a short pointer on zero two. Just move it a little up and down. This one is on zero, this one is on zero, but only after I turn the outer ring of the dial indicator. You can see. Before I finally tighten the screw, I check the alignment. I want this to be parallel. It's only for cosmetic reasons. It just looks better. I tighten the screw and a function check perfect moves easily. If you had tightened the screw too hard, then we may have a friction when moving the axle up or down. Now the dial indicator is ready to use again.